This is a cathode ray tube, sometimes called a CRT or a Braun tube. It is what we used to use to show moving images, such as movies and anime, until the Great Plasma LCD War replaced CRTs with flat screen LCD televisions. The tube itself is a vacuum. A beam of electrons is fired down the tube. Those electrons can be deflected by the electromagnetic coils here. So the beam can be forced up, down, left, right, or any combination. When the electrons themselves hit the phosphorescent screen at the far end, those points begin to glow, creating an image. This is an analog CRT oscilloscope. The electronics on the inside are used to control precisely where the electron beam is deflected to, based on these inputs. Without any deflection, the beam is going to tend towards the center. With a charged electrophorus, I can deflect the beam directly using the electric field generated by the disc. I can also deflect it using a magnet. And of course the direction that it's deflected depends on which pole of the magnet I'm using. Now I'll plug these signal generators into the oscilloscope's front panel so we can control the electron beam directly. So I can tell the beam to sweep back and forth from left to right, or up and down, diagonally, in a circle, or in any number of interesting patterns. If I have the frequency go fast enough, though, it moves so fast it leaves an afterimage, which forms a two-dimensional picture for us. And if I make the horizontal frequency just a little bit faster than the vertical frequency, that image starts to move. You can form all manner of fantastic imagery from this.